Hello friends, so today we are going to create the particle collision thing like uh, when uh, when the particle will um, particle will collide with any rigid body so the rigid body get affected and uh, uh, yeah we will add some force on the particle collision so this is a very simple thing to create so first of all we need to create a cube add a rigid body in it rigid body component just turn off the use gravity then I am going to create a particle system ok so now next thing we go into the collision tab turn on the collision and don't forget to uh, change it to bird and send collision message ok this is the very important part ok so now you can see our particle will start colliding with the rigid body add a script So uh, why adding the collision and particle you can also create the hit effect like the bullet effect and adding the flash and other things ok so now I am going to open this script in visual studio ok so after opening this script I am going to create a public particle system name it part and then also create a public list for particle collision event this name it collision event terminated now go to start function and take a reference for particle and assign a new script to particle collision like this ok so <coughs> here we create a new function on particle collision ok so after this 
now we create a new int number of collision event is equal to in this uh, predefined function we need to pass the game object and the list which we are going to use and then now we are going to take a reference for widget body and uh, here we get component of other dot get component and create a int i equal to 0 for while loop here we use the while i is less than number of calls and event and outside the while loop we just do not here and now we need add a condition if rv not equal to null then we need to create two vectors collision events i dot intersection and vector 3 dot vector 3 force equal to collision event i dot velocity into 10 ok now we add the force to rigid body force like this ok so here we go uh, we have completed our function ok now we need to check whether it is working or not ok so you can see our particle is uh, adding the force to rigid body so this is very simple tutorial for beginners and you can also use this uh, functionality to your game for various kind of features like uh, getting hit by uh, sword slash and